Welcome to the introduction to Azure App Service series, where we are going to explore some of the most useful tools in the cloud ecosystem. Today, we're kicking things off by talking about Azure App Service, a platform that can make hosting and managing your web apps a whole lot easier. So let's start with the basics. What is Azure App Service? Azure App Service is a platform as a service offering from Microsoft. It allows you to build, deploy, and scale web apps, APIs, and backend services with minimal effort. It supports multiple programming languages like .NET, Java, Node.js, Python, so you are not locked up into just one tech stack. So now why is this useful for developers and businesses? Well, App Service takes care of a lot of the heavy lifting that usually comes with running apps like server maintenance, scaling, and security. Traditionally, web applications involve managing servers, configuring firewalls, and monitoring performance manually. With Azure App Service, much of that is automated or built in, giving you more time to focus on your app rather than its backend infrastructure. What I personally find interesting is how Azure App Service fits into different workflows. For example, it integrates seamlessly with GitHub, Azure DevOps, and other CI CD tools. You can push your code and with just a few clicks or commands, your app is deployed in live. This is especially helpful for teams that want to streamline their development cycles. And for those of you working on APIs or other mobile backends, App Service offers built-in scaling options that can adjust based on traffic demand. Whether you're starting small or planning for global traffic, it can handle the spikes without much configuration. So how does App Service on Azure compare to similar services? While other services like AWS Elastic Beanstalk and Google App Engine offer similar functionality, Azure App Service stands out for its deep integration with Microsoft's ecosystem. If you're already using tools like Azure DevOps, Azure Functions, or Logic Apps, it all fits together really nicely. But it's worth noting that the choice of platform often does depend on your specific use case and existing workflows. At the end of the day, it's about finding the right tools for your needs. Azure App Service works best when you want something flexible, scalable, and easy to set up, especially if you're already working within the Azure ecosystem or are planning to move to it. That's it. That's a quick introduction to the Azure App Service. In the next video, we're going to start to roll up our sleeves and walk through setting up our first web app through step-by-step -step instructions. If that sounds helpful, stick around, subscribe for more. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.